In this video, we're going to show you how you can make a change to a purchase order that will go back to the buyer for the buyer to approve. When you first log into Supplier Portal, you do want to click on the Supplier Portal icon. Then you want to go over to Manage Orders and hit the search button if you don't know what your purchase order number is or type in the purchase order number here and search for the purchase order. Here we're gonna go down and we're gonna click on the purchase order. You're gonna scroll down and you're gonna look at it. You're gonna see the quantity and the price in the unit of measure. If you hover over it, it will tell you what the unit of measure is. If this is something that you don't agree with, you can go back up hit the actions button and edit the document. And this is where it's gonna ask you if you wanna create a change order. Over here, you do have to put a very specific description as to why you're making a change. You can put a description as to changing price on line one to current price and date. And you're going to want to scroll down. When you get down to the line, you'll see that the supplier item number is available if you wanted to input your supplier item number. And you see that the quantity and the price is available for you to change. If you wanted to change this to $20, because that's the change, or if you wanted to change the quantity from 20 to 15, because you only have 15 that you can supply, that is a change you can make. Then you can scroll over and see the promised delivery date. If you don't agree with the date that's on here, because you're not going to be able to make that date, please make sure that you're changing it to a date that you can make and make sure that you're changing the date for all the lines, not just one of them. Once you're done, you're gonna scroll back up to the top and you're going to hit the submit button. Once you've hit the submit button, this change order will go over to the buyer for the buyer to look at the changes you have made which is why it's so important to make sure that you're adding your description of what it is you're changing and being very specific. When the buyer decides to agree to the change, they will approve it. And if they decide that they don't agree with the change, then they will reject it. If you have any questions, please reach out to your buyer and they will be able to help you. Thank you.